DM Party leader Raila Odinga today addressed the seventh devolution conference where he pledged to strengthen devolution if he becomes president in 2022. Odinga also promised that dealing with corruption at county level will not be mere words but stern actions will be taken on those found culpable. Our senior political reporter Joel Chacha is in Makweni County and has filed the following report. A few weeks after the global climate change was held in Glasgow today, the seventh devolution conference has been held here in Watema, Kweni County, where over 3,000 delegates have attended, feeling the high temperatures as a result of the climate change. Political temperatures have also taken an upward trajectory ahead of the 2022 general elections. We are celebrating a decade of this bold experiment with the two levels of government, which has been a remarkable journey uh, for our people. It has been full of triumphs and challenges. At this seventh conference, you have decided to confront the elephant in the room of human survival, the issue of climate change. On the other hand, ODM party leader Ray Lodinga has promised to work closely with county governments if he becomes president in 2022. We must devolve more resources to the counties. This should not be a divisive issue. That is what the BBI was intending to do. We must also overcome the challenge of insufficient allocation and delays in this investment of funds by the National Treasury to counties, if counties are to operate efficiently. The corruption menace, according to Odinga, shall be dealt with accordingly by sealing loopholes. The problem of overlapping and duplication of functions by state agencies, corporations, and regional development authorities will also have to be addressed conclusively. Deputy President William Ruto will on Friday close this final annual devolution conference, but he is expected he'll be accompanied by governors allied to him, but next snubbed that these conferences are physically attended by his rival, Raila Odinga. Joel Chacha, Switch TV, Wate, Makweni County. <laughs>